pueden ver está fuerte la ola el oleaje está bastante agresivo Where is this storm, Maria, headed next? CNN meteorologist Chad Myers has the answer. What do we see? Headed to the Turks and Caicos, I believe. Our Polo Sandoval is right there. Now, the storm is not done with the Dominican Republic. The North Shore, which we couldn't get anybody to because the storm was bearing down last night, that's where the damage is being done now. That's where the storm surge is. That's where the winds are right now, from Puerto Plata all the way down on that North Shore of Puerto Rico. We're also still seeing, or Dominican Republic, we're also still seeing rainfall into Puerto Rico proper. Can't tell you or show you the radar because the radar is still broken. In fact, we just got a notice off of the National Weather Service chat that they may be two weeks before they can even get to the radar because there are so many trees down on the roadways, uh, and obviously the radar is on as high a hill as you can get. They put it on top of a mountain, which is a good place for it, until you have to go fix it. Uh Hurricane Maria continues to approach the Turks and Caicos this morning as a major hurricane. Winds are sustained at 115 miles per hour as it now skirts just north of the coast of the Dominican Republic, moving its way to the northwest at 9 miles per hour. That will bring it into the Turks and Caicos late tonight. I do expect some tropical storm force conditions to arrive in the Turks and Caicos Later on this afternoon, those hurricane force conditions into the Turks and Caicos and perhaps the southeastern Bahamas later on this evening into tonight. You can see there in the red shade hurricane warnings posted. Now for the central Bahamas, we do have some tropical storm watches posted as well, but watch closely the track of Maria as we go through the next several days. Here we are at 2 a.m. on Friday, getting very close to moving over or just east of the Turks and Caicos, then taking a bit more of a curve to the north. This is going to take it away from the northwestern Bahamas. We will have to watch its movement once it continues to head north as we go into the weekend. Until you have to go fix it. Uh, there's a storm right now, 115 miles per hour. It is a really big storm eye-wise, about 50 miles across. Think about how it was about 10 miles across when it hit Puerto Rico. That skater with her arms out or with the arms in, the arms are out right now. And it is forecast finally to turn to the right away from the U.S. We've been watching this wiggle for the past couple of days. Does it wiggle too much back to the U.S.? So far, so good today. The answer is no. Second. Follow flashes among people. 